what is going on guys it's your boy ellis and i know i've neglected like everyone that subscribed to this channel for training related content i truly do apologize and please stay tuned to the end of the video i'll be kind of going over something that hopefully will prevent that like a lack of trading content happening in the future and hopefully it makes up for like it makes up for it so if you're not interested in the current topic that the title says I'm going to talk about, then just skip to the end of the video so you know what the update is going to be. But if you are, then just stay to the end of the video and subscribe if you're not, do all that fun stuff. So let's get into this. As the video says, trading signal. So um, again, I'm so bad at planning videos and I just always go off the top of my head. So I'm just going to go straight to it. All right. So um i've got a few dms about signals and why i'm not like first of all let's just say i'm not i'm not 100 percent against signals i'm not saying signals are bad that the worst thing ever and I, I'm, I hate people that sell sig that do signals stuff like that no i'm not saying that um I, there was one point that i was like really into signals as well i was considered doing it for myself considered doing it like paying for signals as well i remember like the first time the first that within the first few months i started trading there was just one particular individual that was London based. I used to always drive nice cars and stuff and he was selling signals. Um, didn't really trust it to be honest. I've never really trusted the whole signal thing, but I didn't really trust it at the time to be honest. And then fast forward like this year, last year, late last year, I saw a news article about the guy that people are after him and all that stuff. So there are some good hearted people out there that genuinely want to help others and there are just some that just go after the money. But Okay, let's get into let's get more into the topic. So signals. The whole reason why I got into trading is to gain independence from a job, from a boss, from all of that stuff. Um, that obviously involves you learning a skill and executing that skill day after day, month after month, yeah, for a period of time to, to reap the benefits from it. I mean, some people say um get get paid while you learn. Some people that use that kind of phrase and some people just like i don't really care i just want to make some extra money i mean i guess that's okay but like when you understand the whole concept behind trading and stuff like that then you might be able to see where i'm coming from so with signals you you still have to re you're relying on someone and that person that you're relying, relying on might not have your best interests at heart so like they 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 don't care what your situation is or you might you don't they might not care it's just about them giving you what you paid for and that's it whereas when you're trading for yourself you've got a different risk tolerant you've got all of this stuff to like you know you can filter through through what suits your needs or what your personality style like create your own style of trading with signals then you just get what's given to you and you take up you take the opportunity and if it doesn't work out it doesn't if it doesn't it does you don't have the independence for like with the whole as i said the whole reason why i started to gain independence from bus to eventually create an income where like you know the whole what everyone always says so i don't know if you have to go through that you know if you're interested in to trade if you're interested in trading so if you're relying on someone to send you signals then where is that independence like if that person was to decide you know what i'm not going to send signals today Oh, I can't be asked. Let's just give this this just just give this random signal because they're paying for the service. Then, you see what I mean? They haven't got your best interest. And if God forbid, um, I'm not wishing bad on anyone, but obviously it happens if something happens to that person where they can't trade anymore, they can't send signals. Then what happens to you? Like if if you've built a, an income off those signals and you now have a, a lifestyle that you like really admire, and then that person stops sending you signals, then what's going to happen you have you don't have a knowledge on how to trade you've just been getting information given to you that you've executed on it so <clears throat> that that's kind of like my take on signals it is something that i could potentially think about doing in the future because it it, it does provide you with a decent income i mean like i've got what on this main channel i've got like thirteen thousand subscribers maybe let's just say 500 people are interested into trading if i say what 20 pound a month for a subscription service for signals then that's ten thousand pound a month that's a lot of money the way people grow their trading accounts is through trading but also through investing capital and growing that trading account because the more money you have in your trading account then the more money you make you know what i mean so if you have one thousand pound and you make one percent that's only ten pound if you had ten thousand pound and you made one percent that's a hundred pound if you had a hundred thousand pound and you made one percent that's a thousand pound I mean, so the more money you have, the more money you make. So with with selling a service to help other people and then getting the income from that that you can then funnel into your trading account, that can only accelerate your your income and accelerate your trading account and et cetera, et cetera. So it's something that I would consider doing. 
I have to trust myself enough to know that I'm go I'm not going to rip people off and I'm actually genuinely doing something good and not just focusing on the money side of it. Because I was saying like, I'm going to show you like this, this, um, this company or this individual that I used to not get signals from, but I kind of learned a strategy and then he done this email analysis program thing that really helped. It's kind of, you can use your signals, but it's not signal, but I'll show you that in a minute. So I could potentially like sign up for a signal service and then sell those signals to someone else. You know what I mean? It's, it's some, it, it can be done, but obviously that's just me being a knob really and not like being genuine. So if I'm going to do something like that, then I want to feel like I'm actually doing good and not just doing it because you know i can make a quick book and then not put like my not put my all into it and, and be a ripoff you know what i mean because obviously people can tell like when things are like not genuine or when it's like not when it's a ripoff let's talk a bit more about this um this comp it's an individual that runs a website that that about trading that teaches trading and whatnot like in, in my first tra trading videos i'm always like telling you guys what companies i use and all that stuff and I genuinely don't want people to think that I'm just saying this because I might make something from them. So I'll show you that these are companies I've actually paid for. I actually use these programs or these platforms myself. And obviously because I resonate with it so much and I put my trust in it, it's the only reason why I would recommend it to anyone. Like I would not recommend something to you that I have not taken on that risk or that experience for myself. So if you look, you will see infinite prosperity. 2017 299 so i always people always ask me what where did i learn to trade and they always say infinite prosperity that proves that i did actually purchase a course of infinite prosperity and the only reason why i recommend it is because i learned so much from them the links below if you want to do that and then the, the company i'm going to talk to you talk about now which is um the trading channel um you can see just on the infinite prosperity the trading channel um there we go go the trading channel right there for 20 pound it was like a subscription based service so it's like 20 20 dollars a month um i think now the price has gone up but obviously i get into just to show you that i'm actually not trying i'm not just like telling you to do this because someone might say this is my company i'll give you x amount like i'm not that individual so i'm gonna show you um an alternative to signals an alternative um you learn that like you learn what what you're getting and you can go about it without waiting for someone to send you something. EAP stands for Email Analysis Program. So it teaches you the strategies that he sends in the emails, basically. So it teaches you the strategies that he used to execute trades and sends it in an email. But then it, rec it records all the emails, like every, like literally, it's so sick, like everything is noted down. So everything is noted down and... Um, you can go back, you can like, I think it started in 2016 actually and from 2016 until 2018 every trade that he's taken in the program is noted down. You can see the equity curve and everything and I think that it's so much better than just like signing up for like a, a random signal service and you have, you don't know the history behind that. You can't see a track record or or whatnot to, to see what, what results that person or the customers from that particular um company has have been generating and another thing about signals or like people will always like advertise a 90 80 percent strike rate it's so easy to, to to say i like you have a 90 percent strike rate i mean all you really have to do is risk more for less reward so you might let's let's hope you can see this over here i'll show you exactly what i mean by risking more for risking more for less reward so I do like a quick um, position thing. And let's say, let's say there's a double top right here. And this person is giving you a signal based on this double top, but you might not know what the strategy is, the strategy is that he's using, but he's giving you a signal based on this double top. So someone might advertise a 90% strike rate. So now how they might go about doing a 90% strike rate is, um, so at this double top, they, there's resistance, so they will sell the market. So let's say, over here come on so bam so they might that might be the reward and that might be the risk so you can see the reward is so small and the risk is so huge so the chances of getting up to there is a lot less than the chances you know what i mean like you can see where i'm going with this having an inverse risk to reward can can falsely make you think that it's a it's it, it might be a 90% strike rate, but when you lose, you're losing so much that it, it don't even make sense. Cause like, what, you're losing 
40 pound and every time you win you gain in 10 pound you know what i mean like you win two trades you lose two trades you see you know what i mean that yeah if you don't know much you can see how that can be falsely interpreted whereas a, a professional or someone that knows about training would know that like even a 40 percent strike rate is still good with a good risk to reward who might think you need to have like an 80 percent strike rate like winning 80 percent of the time to be good but it doesn't really matter it, that doesn't really like once you know about training then you'll understand so anyway let's head over to this screen i'll do a screen record and i'll kind of show you what i'm talking about um about how this this company does the how yeah okay so i just thought a screen record obviously i can't really show you everything because people pay for this program and i can't just like show you the, what what the strategy that people use because obviously it's a service and if i just give that away that's kind of like that's not fair because i wouldn't want someone to you know what I mean? Like people pay for it, and for me just to give it, for, I can't do that. That's that's it's mor morally, it's not morally. I can't even speak. It's just not right for me to do that. So I just like just jump straight to the end of the year preview. This is for like this is so this is basically a sum up of the the whole of two thousand seventeen. So let's pause the video for a second. So every single every sing from the first week of two thousand seventeen, from the first week of two thousand seventeen all the way to the last week in 2017 he's recorded every single trade make weekly reviews about all the emails that he sends out about trading opportunities so you could class as all the signals that i sent you can you can say all the signals that he sends out about the trading opportunities that he's taking so it even though he, he he does address that it's not a signal service it's an email analysis program so it helps you to identify them once you've watched the training videos so that's that's the purpose of behind it, but you can use it as a signal service. But obviously I'm not telling you what to do. I'm gonna show an alternative and also what I would consider doing. So, okay, let's jump to, let's make this screen bigger. So the equity curve for 2017. So um, I don't really wanna, so you can see, he show you the gains, the losses, the pips, blah, blah, blah. 62% gain over that period that year. You can see the equity curve, all the ups and downs. I mean, some people, when you join a signal service, you might not know what cycle it's in. I mean, you might hear about a signal service because it's doing this, because it's doing that, and it's going all the way up, and then you join right there, and then that happens, and you're like, oh, the signal service is crap. You see what I mean? So it's not, that's why you need to understand how trading works, because it's, it's not all about just, just going all, it's just not all about just going straight up like that. So, as you can see, every trade is recorded and every drawdown, everything. I mean, it's just like, for me personally, it's just like, wow, that's just like one of the best ways for anyone to really learn, learn, learn why you make money in a sense. Yeah, but enough talking about that program. There are downsides. The only downside I would say to this um, program itself or this um, platform, I don't even want to say it, this course the only downside i'll say to it is that <clears throat> it doesn't teach you it doesn't train you from the ground up of becoming a trader as you can see i i, I had infinite infinite prosperity and i still had this uh, with infinite prosperity <clears throat> it teaches you from the ground you know i just quickly go over on their website if i can log in you can see like what i mean about the difference of what they, they don't offer but what is like what is kind of needed to build someone from the ground up. So um, I've completed all the lessons. What's this? I also got a new community, that's sick. So it's like their own trading community. I didn't even know about this. Um, I'll do that later. Anyways, so let's go to the lessons. Um, come on quickly. So here are all the lessons with infinite prosperity. So. From the start the introduction um i think these two lessons are free or i don't know click the link below if you if you're interested and i think the, the first two lessons are free and then after that then you, they'll show you the payment plans and whatnot that you saw that i paid 2.99 which is for a silver membership i, I don't I, I don't even care about the gold membership if i'm honest so you can get a silver membership if you want to so then you go into trading psychology risk management technical analysis financial brokers trading and edge mindset goal setting journaling passive in forex trends it just goes on. There's so much things that it's getting so dark. Let's turn this light on. So, yeah, that's what I mean. Like this builds you from the ground up. Talks about psychology, risk management, everything. 
whereas the other platform is mainly for people that maybe already have not know how to trade a bit or as you call it earn while you learn but yeah those are the difference if you literally know nothing about trading and it's your first time if you're watching a trading video then i recommend infinite prosperity if you want to trade signals if you want some kind of like learn while you earn kind of thing then i recommend the other company but both of them will be down in the description below um if you made it this far if you just skipped to the end then what i'm going to do is because i the this channel is mainly for like car related stuff and vlogs and stuff like that when when it comes around to making trading videos sometimes i just don't feel like i should upload a trading video to the channel because it doesn't get that much interaction and then it kind of like puts people off that subscribe for like the main content to like you know what i mean so i'm going to make a completely separate channel the link will be down below to the second channel that i'm just going to be purely focusing on trading related content and financial related content and all that kind of stuff and on that channel so the link will be down below for that channel make sure you go subscribe yep that's the announcement and hope this hopefully this video was helpful in some way if sorry for a mumble on a lot of you will say that because obviously i don't write a script down i just talk from the top of my head um i think i'm fairly good at doing that because obviously everything that i want to speak about is already there it's just to get it out but then when i finish making the video i'm always like damn i should have said that but anyways that's it make sure you subscribe drop a like leave a comment go subscribe to the other channel that all the future um trading content will be on and go have a look on the website of the companies that i would recommend and yeah that's it for that video that's it for this video guys i will see you in a next one bye bye oh yeah let's look at this community thing now my fellow traders, where are you lot? Ooh.